EA, 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 what are we going to do with you? I'm telling you right now, EA, we need theatre mode in the next instalment of your FIFA game, FIFA 12. Um, guys, I get so many moments in rank matches when I want to capture a certain save, I want to capture a certain tackle, and I just can't do it, you know, get different angles of it, you know, I have a capture card, as you see, but here, for this, for the for these other replays I'm showing you, I've had to go to match highlights, and there's only a certain amount of match highlights you can actually capture and like um, get some good angles of. Anyway, that was my first proper overhead kick, and Drogba is a freaking beast, and he sure loves his headers. But I was uh, playing two, um, two v two, two two v two matches here, just two goals from it, and um, I was playing with uh, talents. Some of you may recognise him from his YouTube channel, and um, yeah, some good matches. We didn't lose today, so, and uh, scored some good goals. But I'm just using this as an example of why I want theatre mode in the next. Um, FIFA game, we've seen it in Black Ops and we've seen it in um, the Halo series, it started off in the Halo series so we really need that and um, basically if you want to know how to do that Rabona cross right there, just hold the, I play in the 360, so if anyone knows the PS3 buttons for what I'm about to say, just put that in a comment as well um, basically you hold LT and you tap X in the direction you want to pass to, so it's very simple you can either cross with it pass with it or exploit it to score with it as well it's like that scoop chip on FIFA 2010 when people just keep scoring with it and it's uh, very easy to do when you get the use of it and people with the flare attribute are only allowed to do it. anyway guys comment if you agree with me that we need theatre mode in the next instalment of this amazing FIFA series anyway guys stick around for match of the week episode 5 on Saturday peace out guys